So the U.S. president has rightly, though belatedly, proclaimed that this is not good. We agree with that. What we don't agree with is this. America should be the last country to lecture Russia, or anybody for that matter, on nuclear arsenal. The United States was the first country in the world to test a nuclear weapon. It remains the only country in the world to use a nuclear weapon on another country. Our next report explores the dark side of America's nuclear program. 74 years ago, the world changed forever. America was looking for a quick way to end the Second World War. The administration, under President Harry S. Truman, decided to drop nuclear bombs on Japan. The goal was simple, destroy Japan's ability to fight. An American B-29 bomber called the Enola Gay dropped the first nuclear bomb on August the 6th, 1945. It was called Little Boy, the bomb wiped out 90% of Hiroshima. Around 80,000 people were killed instantly. Three days later, America dropped another bomb called Fat Boy on Nagasaki. That one took more than 40,000 lives. Within days, America ended the Second World War, but left lifelong scars on survivors. It was a watershed moment in human history. President Truman's decision to use nuclear power is a black spot in America's history. But that hasn't stopped America from gathering more nukes. In fact, the United States has one of the biggest nuclear stockpiles in the world. As of March this year, America had more than 1,000 strategic nuclear warheads. They are deployed on 656 intercontinental ballistic missiles submarine-launched ballistic missiles, and strategic bombers. In fact, America is now in position to build more nukes. Recently, President Donald Trump withdrew America from the Intermediate-Range Nuclear Forces Treaty with Russia. This decades-old treaty was a landmark arms control pact that limited development of ground-based missiles. Trump had blamed Russia for violating the agreement. One side has not been adhering to it. We have, but one side hasn't. So unless they're going to adhere, we shouldn't be the only one. This move to junk the treaty would very well kick off a new arms race between two traditional rivals. But can America be trusted with more nukes? By the Pentagon's own admission, America has a rather poor track record of protecting its nukes. There has been as many as 33 incidents in the history of America's nuclear program when it lost control of its nukes. These incidents are defined as broken arrows by the Pentagon, a serious accident involving a nuclear weapon that could have threatened the public. What's more worrying is the fact that most Americans do not trust Donald Trump with the nuclear button. Last year, a study found that about 52% of Americans feel that President Trump might launch a nuclear attack without an explanation. Bureau Report, We On, World Is One.